As we near toward the end of the football season, only one Marlboro youth football team remains. The fourth grade Marlboro Panthers, and they're just days away from playing in the D1 Super Bowl against the Worcester Cowboys. Coach DeVincent and some of his players spoke about the season and how exciting it is to be playing in the big game. This, this group of boys is incredible. They're just like special to my heart. Last year we went 0-8, um, lost every game. We played Worcester, we lost 14-13 on a Monday night game, so it's kind of crippling. But uh, this year the kids are just absolutely into it all, all the time practice, every game. Like the kids, they're just they're really, really, really blended together. Like the chemistry is just awesome. Uh, really fun. Last year we didn't really make it, so it's going to be fun this year. Um, I'm really excited and be really, really excited if we win. Super Bowl is my first time being in a Super Bowl. First time. How many How many years have you been playing football? Four. It's really exciting because it's my second year in tackle and I don't really have that much experience. No. Real exciting and nervous. Yeah. Why are you nervous? Because I haven't been to a Super Bowl yet. <laughs> um, it's very exciting from. It's a big difference from last year. Last year we lost the first playoff game and we've made it this far. Coming into this season, Marlboro has taken on several new kids from Hudson and these young Panthers share the different reasons why they're happy to have them on their team. Last year there were different names of people and I want to know new people have more friends. They're good teammates. Yeah. I like to make friends and now I get a chance to make more. The stands are expected to be jam packed for next weekend's game. Coach DeVincent talks about the support they've received, while the players list who will be there cheering them on. There's been a ton of support for the fourth grade. Uh, we have a ton of home games, and everybody's came out, different grades, you know, fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. They've all came to watch us play football. Um, you know, aunts, uncles, grandparents have all came to the game. It's just really exciting for, uh, you know, nine and ten-year-olds to play football. It's awesome. How many people from your friends and family are going to be at the game this weekend? My mom, my dad, my brother, my grandma, and grandpa. My mom, my dad, and my brother. My whole family and uh, my best friend uh, that I know at school. My entire family. Every every single person from your family is going to be there? Yeah. With it being such a big game for these young athletes, most don't need additional motivation. But a few of the Panthers mentioned what they do to get pumped up prior to hitting the field. Is there like a pregame like ritual or like a song that you listen to that kind of like gets you fired up and ready to go out there and hit people? Um, Rocky. You listen to the Rocky song? Yeah. I like to listen to rap. Anyone in particular? Uh, Eminem. I like pop. Yeah? And who in particular? Um, pop song. The Cowboys will certainly be a tough team to beat, but this Panther team seems to be confident they'll bring home a championship. I think we have a great chance. I mean, we only have 17, 18 kids going into that game. I think they have 28, but uh, we're playing real good football right now. We're confident going into that game and giving them a good, good football game. I think we got it. Why are you so confident? I don't really know. <laughs> the game will be played on November 12th at 10 a.m. in Grafton, so make sure you get out and show your support. From Ward Park, Mapasaccio, WMCT Sports.